Hello YouTube and welcome back into some Let's Play Civilization 6. Uh, just taking a brief gander here. So we're working towards flight, which requires an industrial era or later wonder. We're working on one in Ruhr. We also have the opportunity to potentially buy this engineer. We're also working on the engineer points, but I could certainly accelerate this. I don't see the reason to not really just snag this, right? Like, why don't we just grab this? I I'm not committing my faith to much else. And then let's try to let's try to get that Eureka, um, and then we can in the meantime go after Steam Power because we they're both on the same path, pretty much. So we'll go Steam Power first, and try to get our nice Ruhr Valley. Uh, Ruhr is going to be focused like this city is probably eventually going to be focused on producing units, whether that's um, whether that's planes or tanks or whatever. I'm not sure, uh, but that is likely going to be their pri primary goal. What up, Major Bang Geek? How you doing, dude? 34 gold per turn off of that, baby. That's pretty good. Um, I do need builders, and we're running the policy. Although, we're about to get the uh, public works policy, so it's a little... Is there something I can do that's better than that? Have my harbor. Have this. Maybe another amphitheater is actually okay. Uh, we've been earning great people, and our culture is a little bit weak. Go for railroads across the empire now. Uh, railroads are are railroads require uh, one iron and one coal. And I think most of my uh, trade routes are going off to sea, so I don't see the benefit. It's also very very tedious. What's up, Hash? Don't I need encampments? I don't think we need encampments. Um, when we're doing this late of, of domination, not to say a general wouldn't help us somewhere. Um, and we do have some. We've been working on some encampments, right? Is that not true? Okay, I lied. <laughs> Why did I think we, we made some? No, I did. Yeah, we made two encampments already. Um, yeah, so maybe we'll get a general, maybe not. But when I think when we're doing like tank and like super late, like bombers, possibly possibly like the powerful ships and things, I don't think it's as important as like having a general at the same time you have oligarchy if you're doing like an early war type of a thing. What were we doing with this guy over here? Oh, yeah, the coal city. The coal city. Bada bing. Very nice. Would also like this tile. Because that'll be a good hacienda. Or hacienda. <laughs> Coliseum turn 151. Just saying that out loud so people can get used to new timings of wonders Did you and things. Build a castle in the air? Here is one. Brought down to earth and fixed for the wonder of ages. <laughs> it happens, Great Oz. Sometimes people don't like my ideas either. What's this? Wow, so many uh, meteors. Yeah, we're really... Uh, how, how late did we get the oracle? How late did we get the oracle? Would have been one of the first things we did, yeah? Right there. Turn 61. Turn 61, we got it. I think I want my capital to have a harbor. I want them to help with ships, I think. It's either that or just give them an aerodrome. I guess that's probably fine, too. So I was thinking of going for Grandmaster's Chapel. 
just for the option of faith buying, but this isn't even like a half a unit, really. Kind of weird. Do harbors help with naval units? Um, I mean, they give them extra XP, just like the uh, encampment and buildings give extra XP to your uh, your your land units. So nice. All right. So that's pretty sweet. This is a plus six theater square now. Don't think I'll go for potato. I think I probably want to crank out builders. But you know what? A spy for some uh, diplo visibility could be a thing. I hate. I hate doing this. This is so dumb. They don't have much else that's like good to get. We're working on Venetian here still. Just get another spy there. <laughs> oh dear. Okay. Well, <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> uh, choo choo choose you. I know that's linked in our Discord. I don't have a link handy though for you. <laughs> I can answer it real quickly. Why don't I like this? Why don't I like doing this plus five commercial hub? Because a big, a, you either want a harbor or a commercial hub because you want every city to give you a, a trade route capacity. We've already done that here. So like a big part of the benefit of, of doing this is not there anymore. Because they, they do similar things. So I don't like that. Hey, Bows. How you doing? What's up, my dude? Do I want to... I don't really... I, I really just want the gold. I don't even care about the envoy. Happy not my birthday. Thanks. One week. One week to go. <laughs> yeah, Rome was the final one. Isn't that funny? We thought it was Japan. These guys could actually use a water mill. A little bit stifled. I should wait for public works. Maybe they'll go away. <laughs> go away. Go away. Please. Hmm. That's maybe more of a project city at this point. Like maybe I need some uh, missile cruisers to take out all the barbs. Ah, oh, you're thinking of a T-Rex, Hash. You're thinking of a T-Rex. <laughs> oh, no, no, no. We uh, This is my first time building Haciendas. Or Haciendas. Sorry. I keep pronouncing the H. Um, my first time building them. They're pretty good. I think they get amazing when they hit their next level of... Uh, like upgrade, right? So when you hit rapid development and replaceable parts, I think they're actually like super insane. Uh, now those aren't those aren't gimmies, right? Because they're they're pretty far. So uh, replaceable parts um, and what was the other one? Rapid development. Is that over here? I don't even remember. Where is it? Is that super late? 
Oh, yeah. All the way up here. So really, really late in the game to, to hit those things. Uh, I think the more doable one is the replaceable parts, and we'll hit that sometime soon. Um, but yeah, if you can, if you can hit the, like, I think late game tile improvement wise, it's probably might be the best in the game. Um, but yeah, production gold housing, sign me up. Super good. Hey, Wilbedros, how you doing? What's up, Van Bradley? What's up, dude? How you doing? Trying to steal my money. How dare they. <laughs> Great Oz. I love that. <laughs> I don't want to. I'm not ready for war, so no thank you. We're working on it, Blue Wings. This passed, but we're not involved. So that's fine. So do I want to counter spy? Where was this? Siphon funds here. You know, if I go protect this government plaza with this spy, it protects a whole lot of districts. So I think that is what I will be doing here. Like protecting our best districts, probably. Um, one turn walls, and then I'm going to work on builders. We're going to run skyscrapers and public works here in a second. <laughs> I like this bit that you're doing, Great Oz. It's pretty delightful. Uh, you can use you can use spies offensively and de defensively. There's a there's a list of missions that you get to choose from. Defensively, it pretty much is protecting your districts. Um, and when you when you counter spy like this, it protects not only the district that the spy is in, but all the surrounding districts, which is, which is why this was a good choice. Um, offensively, you can send them to sabotage specific di districts, steal money, steal great works, uh, steal tech boosts, um, sabotage space. Uh, sabotage production, sabotage spaceports, things like that. So lots of lots of cool stuff that you can do with spies. I've actually liked the spy mechanic in this game kind of from day one. So four envoys. What do we want to do with them? We lost one of our commercial city states, which is a bit sad. I guess I don't really want to do much with those. Nice Coliseum. You're building this, so we can. Uh, we're we're about to be able to shuffle some great works and open up spots for that. So that's good. Big Ben. Oh yeah, that's true too. Big Ben spot, and we're rich, so that could be awesome. It's a good uh, good call, Peppermint Butler. Yeah, if I could show you again, I know for sure it protects the adjacent districts, too. I was doing it in our uh, Maya game. <laughs> I'm not going to tech stop, uh, Great Us. I'm enjoying your bit too much. Hey, Dun Dun. Hey, man, congrats on launching your game. If you want to plug that, please, please feel free, dude. I don't mind at all. Southside Spur, dude. Thank you for the 32 months. So hype for next Friday? I'm not. I'm so old. hype for next Friday. I'm officially one of the olds. I don't like it. I don't like it anymore. Thank you so much for the 32 months, my friend. Welcome back. Welcome back. It'll be a fun day on stream. That's for sure. Taking my tiles. It is arguable. A common mistake that people... Okay. 
So builders, I'm going to give up on, a, on gold for just a little bit here while we run skyscrapers and work on our wonders. That still makes sense. <laughs> Thanks, Slim. There you go. Done, done. Yeah, I can't wait to try it out. Uh, Dun Dun's company is it, I mean is that is that appropriate to say your your company releasing Haxity uh, a, a deck building rogue light and I can't wait to try it out this weekend cheers my dude much love to you and congratulations on the release <laughs> yeah we can we can do uh railroad for era score if we need to all right skyscrapers in now I can go I can go directly to this. <laughs> what do I want? I want oil. Hey admin. Admin, that's a great limerick. <laughs> Thank you, buddy. Yeah, I'll delay this because we're going to get this rare. All right, builders. I want haciendas. Governor promotion. I don't know what that's doing at the moment. The game is Hack City. And here's the Steam Link. Brand new. Oh, T, I forgot your question. What was it? Dude, I'm sorry. What was your what was your question, my butt my dude? <laughs> I forgot it. You're welcome. All right, end of the era coming up. 128, we need to get to 143 for a golden. This is gonna be era score for sure. Uh, not to mention we have Taj now. I don't really want that. You know, I could buy a general, although industrial and modern general probably not doing that much. I was thinking of the uh, the more than halfway buy here. Maybe we commit. Um, maybe we go max Pingala for era score since we could potentially get this merchant. I think we've got some time here. Oh, you were asking about how do you how do you determine how much of a given resource that factories use? Um, so I mean, your are, wait factories or power plants? Factories or power plants? And like how they work. It is. A, it does look like a prime Golden Gate game, doesn't it? Do I let this finish naturally? The Commonwealth of Venice in their armory. Have... I should have watched that video. We don't build this very often, do we? Uh, Venetian Ars Arsenal, pretty uh, sweet. I mean, the power plants are going to consume power equal to the, the their needs. If there are a bunch of powered buildings that the power plant is trying to power, it can consume. Uh, I, I think it tries to accommodate that as best it can. Not to say that one power plant will be able to do it all, but um, I'm not really sure the details of it, to be honest. T. I don't I don't do industrial zone slash power stuff enough to really weigh in. So 
Sounds about right, Malt. All right, so that pushes us up to, to only needing 10 era score. Honestly, between these, we should be fine. So I can just go, I can just go get this. If, now, if I get beat to Rur here, I'll be obviously super sad. But we'll get over it. This will be plus four. When this is done. Okay, what do you want? A builder? Builders everywhere. Great Oz, I haven't seen the dino fact about how was it is it the um Is it like the Brontosaurus that wasn't real? And there was like some feud between scientists that like and and I they was like it, they like combined the bones of like different dinosaurs or something. Am I making that up? Can I get my local uh, dino facts to weigh in on that? Oh, did you post that one a couple ago? Okay, I didn't read it. Cards on the table. I didn't read it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Um, it's mostly experience. Um, how, how can someone become, I mean, look, don't compare yourself to me. Okay. Like, don't, I have, I'm approaching 4,000 hours in the game. Now, granted, I record content and stuff. Not every minute of this is playing. Um, but honestly, like the best way to learn this game is just to learn from others. Learn from like, if, if I, if, if what I do is your style, learn from me. If not, there are tons of other awesome content creators out there that you can go learn from. Um, highly recommend uh, just about everybody out in the Civ space, which is awesome. Um, and then, yeah, it's time, it's effort, it's uh, it, it's uh, it's understanding, having a broad knowledge of the game. Um, and also, thank you for saying that I'm good. I appreciate that. Buy a builder here. Uh, it's not a bad idea. So now we're eight turns. So if I just chop something for them, like maybe this woods, then we get this. Malt, thank you for the two months. Welcome back. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. But honestly, just just enjoy the game. Like that's the best way to to get better. Because if you're having fun, you're gonna want to keep playing. And if you keep playing, you're gonna get better because you're playing. Um, so I would just have fun with it. Don't stress about being good or being perfect. Um, just try to try to learn something new each game. Try to try to improve. Little little steps, you know. Wee babby steps. There goes Potato Palace. Um, see, he's 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 got plenty of salt, but nothing to eat. So I guess we're gonna give him horses. Yeah, and given that I don't I don't actually stream eight hours a day, right, TL? I really do want this harbor. A couple more builders would make sense though. Send this up there. Maybe I'll buy you one. Send this over here. And then, yeah, honestly, Petra needs one. They'll be able to build plenty soon. Yeah, these, these are nice for gold. Um, I think they're a great tile improvement. Like I said, I think they get really ridiculous with the uh, upgrades they can eventually have. Rut row. Ooh, 
Quetzalcoatl, that's a uh, that's a magic card. <laughs> everything I everything I need to know about life and dinosaurs I learned from Magic the Gathering. What's up, remember? How you doing? Still having fun with this? Yes, I'm having a great time with this game. Uh, we're getting close to we've got the Venetian. We're, we've got our uh, we're prepping for our big war, our big our big hurrah. I don't really need to get these, do I? Because we're, we're going to have uh, civil en civil engineering. Or no. Steel. Steel we shall have at some point. So I'm not actually changing the adjacency bonus of this industrial zone. It's one, two, and then, f then two other mines will make it four. So even though I'm going to clear this stone, I think it's it's it makes a lot of sense to do that because we're not actually changing it. Wonder if this should be haciendas. Probably should be. Really, Dad? Oh no! Just just cause Corona stuff. That's no that's no bueno. All right, six turns on the era. Rur coming up. Can you not? I'm busy. Wait, you have that and this. No, wait. This one. Yeah, that's that stinks, stat. That's definitely sad. What did you learn? Holy cow. The industrial heart of Germany practically stopped beating. Hardly anyone worked. Hardly anything ran. The population of the Ruhr area had to be supported by the rest of the country. Sweet. All right. So Ruhr Valley city up to 88 production. We'll obviously get better with these <laughs> improvements. Got our encampment already. Oh, wow. A little bacon boy. That's a bummer. So this isn't canalable. Oh, it has to be like next to it. Right. Whatever. All right. Couple more builders. Dub this wonderful domination. Nice. So this is back to, well, five now? Why are you five now? Four mines, one strategic, and one of these. Two, three, four. Oh, five. Duh. Two mountains. <laughs> I missed the one that Machu Picchu was on. It's very famously on a mountain. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so dumb. Have I continued to play as two staters to cause disasters prior to settling? Uh, I really like that. We had a lot of fun in the beginning of the game with that. Um, but I haven't I haven't done it. We we missed the next opportunity for it. I, I, I'm, I'm, what I'm 
what I'm testing with you, Great Oz, is how committed are you to this bit? Oh, um, so here's your counter spy for those that were asking about this. Protect the city center and all adjacent districts from enemy spies. Like, this is just how it works. When you counter spy, you protect it and adjacent districts. Yep, we've got coal. Uh, we're looking for aluminum. Who's our first target? I see one, exactly one naval city that he has. I'm a little nervous about Hi. this. Do you think he's bringing this my direction? Do you think this is an early birthday present for me from China? Maybe I'll go here. Also, can I steal money from somebody? He doesn't have much money, so maybe we'll go siphon funds somewhere. Monsa Musa seems like a great siphon funds target. Thousand a piece. All right, let's do that. Let's try to get some levels up on that. Rip. <laughs> All right, great Oz. Thank you. Thanks for the entertainment. So five turns to go. I only need five more era score. Apart from the sanity, Are we going to lose a city. sneaky religious? Nah. No, we're okay. We'll head up that direction. I'll leave skyscrapers in so that we can get this last wonder. It should be enough era score for us then to keep our golden. All right. And now we go to flight slash radio. Could I build a national park? I don't have the faith for it. Basically gonna chop everything up now. As we as we start to wind or approach the end of the game. Almost a, an amazing canal. So close. Is he, does he continue doing that? He's got a soothsayer there. I think you're doing that on purpose there, friend. All right, so moment of truth. All of this should stay on. We should only lose one production from this tile. That is factually correct. That is amazing. So those forest fires do add to this. That's awesome. All right, I'm ready for this harbor now. Oh, did this? Oh, these got destroyed. We got to get our coal back.
Not that I'm going to democracy, but a couple sewers are okay. Next turn, Oxford. Sweet. So now I can start some aerodromes the slash hangers Oxford, know all there is to be known. and get us prepped but for this. But we have to discover aluminum first, then we'll work on the bottom half of the tech tree, go find oil, uh, and then yeah. Is the production that you get from your chop limited to the city that Magnus is in? Yeah, any chop, any chop that you do, whether it's production or food or anything, is local to that city. Unless it's something like copper, and then it just obviously goes into your treasury. So there we go. If you can walk away from man is a millet radio is a We are more than good on on uh oh, Do we really not have aluminum? He's got a lot. Ooh, we have one. I can't really go, like, settle that city, really. Really, really. So we have one? Oh, yeah, I forgot about this guy. <laughs> uh, we could actually go try to settle aluminum slash coal uh, area. <laughs> we'll try. I think that, is that it? Yep, that was it. Okay, well, uh, now we know. Yeah, now we know where we're going. He's got a bunch of it, so we're definitely gonna go kill Mansa Musa first. Um, the good news is we can get this one online. What do you do? Five hundred gold and a governor title. Sure. So Big Ben, huh? I don't really want to build three biplanes for this. Like, they're not worth the aluminum. I'd be building them just for the Eureka, or the oil, even. Um, hmm. I am going to put a cut in the video right here. Uh, this one a little bit short. The rest have been pretty long. Uh, but I, I, I need a, a second to think about this, so thank you so much for watching, and we will see you all in the next one. We are winding down the Renaissance era here. Seems like a good time to cut it. So thank you so much if you're watching. We'll see you in the next one.